My name is Miles McDonough. I'm Resource Optimization and Planning Team Leader with Quilche Chorinta, which is an Irish semi-state company who manages uh, about a million acres of forest land in Ireland. Um, it's, it's difficult to know where to start um, why we chose Remsoft Technologies um, because we're really embracing the whole suite of products and covering a lot of bases in our own business, I suppose specifically around uh, planning. Um, one of the key areas, for example, is in, in the whole sphere of uh, certification. We've carried FSC certification since 2001. And um, we are also regulated by our government regulator. Um, and it's in those areas that uh, we need extra tools to probe, for example, new regulations that are proposed to be brought in, um, as well as new trends in certification and auditing. Um, and we feel that maybe if we can use these technologies correctly, we can sit down with these groups and tease out what their exact requirements are and maybe achieve a win-win whereby we can even over-achieve what they're looking for at a, a lower cost to ourselves. So that's, that's one area that, that we're looking forward to, to REMSOFT uh, implementation being, being complete. Another key area is in the uh, supply and demand side where we're using Allocation Optimizer to uh, look at all the sources of demand for, for our material in the country. We supply about 85% of all the round logs in Ireland um, and because we're a semi-state and, and government owned we have a certain obligation to, to, to keep keep timber rolling to all the, the many customers we have throughout the country. And we have a very modern processing sector uh, with a high capacity and uh, the resource we have is, you know, it's, it's fairly well meeting what they need but not quite. So the, there is a big pressure there to, to supply these guys uh, as efficiently as possible and uh, we're working out how to do that. They're involved in big export markets and we're figuring out how we can serve them as efficiently as possible so that the whole uh, value chain is, is really optimized and running as smoothly and, and efficiently as possible. Um, a third area that we uh, see great benefits is in the whole workload in terms of our planning staff. Um, we hope to use uh, Stanley and Remsoft Tactical Planner to help us bring together and, and balance all the objectives that are uh, imposed on us in terms of forest management, be that regulation, auditing from an FSE point of view, the, the kind of tightness of supply and demand I've mentioned um, and bring that all together uh, in, in one place and help our forest managers uh, produce the best plans they can. For example, at the moment they use up to 29 spatial data sets to try and figure out in their own heads uh, the shape of felling coops uh, for each planning period and uh, when you combine that with the huge number of policies and plans and guidelines that they're using, uh, it is a daunting task for our uh, resource planners. So we're, we're hoping to help them out in that area with, uh, as I say, Stanley and, and uh, Remsoft Tactical Planner. Um, and as well as that, you know, the guidelines that they use, um, they're not really up to date as regards the, the processing sector I mentioned, where the sector is now highly productive using small dimension logs. And the traditional guidelines that our forest managers and planners have used are based on a slightly 
larger log and maybe slightly outdated. So we want to move to an economic rotation based on current products and current demand. And uh, as we all know, in the industry, uh, demand can vary from year to year and you can have natural disasters. And we, we do want to have the agility to respond to those quite quickly, which given the complex nature of a kind of a semi-manual process that they're conducting at the moment, it's very difficult to react quickly. Uh, and we do hope to use the Remsoft products to help us improve that agility.